everyone so today i thought i would do my october favorites since i haven't showed you of any of the products that i've been loving through october so if you want to see my october favorites then just keep on watching so i'm going to start off with like face product first and then work my way down so i, ha I did have to put this in my october favorites because i absolutely love this and i have got a video on it as well so this is the Nivea Men Post Shea Balm I use this every single day and I have got a review if you want to see that I will leave that in the description box that if you do want to go out and check that out it had to be in my monthly favourites because it just does keep the makeup on all day long whereas normally my makeup would just slide off but I'm not going to go on too much about this because I have got a full review on it so I'll leave that in the description box but I did have to put this in my monthly favourites because it is one of my favourite primers to use before I apply my foundation. Then my next thing that I'm going to show you is actually a makeup remover and it is the Garnier Micellar Cleansing Water. This is only the mini version which is 125 millilitres but I absolutely love this. I use this every single day as well to take off my makeup. I do apply this with a wipe and then just obviously wipe my face and it does just help to melt the makeup off my face which this does just do that. It does help to just melt the makeup off and you don't really need to really scrub really hard or anything like that I will have to repurchase this one so I did have to put this in my multi favourite as well the next thing that I absolutely love as well is actually the lipstick colour that I'm wearing and it is the Jordana Matte Lipstick in Taupe now as you can see I have damaged it quite a lot because I did end up putting the lid back on it when the lipstick wasn't entirely down so I have just sort of destroyed the lipstick but you can still use it and I absolutely love this lipstick it's got like a vanilla -y smell like the MAC lipsticks and this was like super super affordable I think it was like £2.50 and I got this from eBay I have this one in 38 taupe and a lot of people rave about this lipstick so I did have to go out and get my hands on it and I have been wearing it throughout October so I had to put this in my favourites as well if it's sort of like a mauve brown red sort of lipstick it's quite unique in colour so that is why I love this one so I, I had to put this in my favourites the packaging is a bit of a downfall cheap looking wise but the product is really really good so if you do want like a really mauve sort of fall of a brown lipstick then I would highly recommend this one I also have another two lip favourites and the first one is the Sexy Mother Pucker Gloss Stick by Soap and Glory and this is in the shade Nude I have been absolutely loving wearing this to work and I did have to be one of my favourites as well so this is in the shade Nude and it's like a really nice pink it's like a gloss and it's like a peachy pink sort of colour like that and it's really really pretty it's a very very neutral sort of work appropriate lip gloss so I would highly recommend this as well if you have dry lips like myself because my lips do tend to dry out throughout the day especially when I'm working so I had to put this in my favourites as well and I can't remember how much this was but I will leave a link to all these products below if you do want to go and buy them but I absolutely love this it's really moisturising so I would definitely recommend this if you like hydrating lip glosses as well the next favourite is a lip liner this is the Essence Lip Liner in Satin Mauve which you would probably have seen in my recent haul video so this is in the shade Satin Mauve it's like a really nice mauve brown pink sort of shade what is it right there it's a really really nice everyday sort of lip liner it just goes with a lot of different lipstick colours and I absolutely love this it's really creamy really moisturising and it is a great great pigmented colour so if you haven't tried any of the Essence lip liners then I would definitely recommend them my next favourite is mascara and this is the Essence I Heart Extreme Volume Mascara again another Essence product if you haven't tried Essence then I would definitely recommend Essence because they are a super, super affordable brand and they their products are really really good for the price so if you haven't tried any of the essence products then I definitely would because I do really really like them myself and this one was like £2.80 for this mascara and it does really like a volume and length and lashes quite well it is quite a big brush but I do really, really like it the formula is quite nice it's not um, super wet but it's not super dry it's just in between but I do really, really like this and again it's super affordable and then my last favourite is actually a face brush and this is the NARS ITA or ITA brush I'm not entirely sure if this is real because I did purchase it off eBay and it was only like £11 so I'm not entirely sure but it is super super soft it does shed a little bit but not too much um, it is really really affordable as well you can go on eBay and have a look they do sell a lot of these brushes it does say NARS on it but again I'm not entirely sure if it is 
100% genuine but it is a still really really good brush so obviously if you don't want to go out and spend a lot of money on the real NARS one then I would suggest heading on to eBay and see if you can find one of these ones because I use this every single day to contour and I do really like it so I had to put this in my favourites as well. So that has been my October favourites. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you do like these monthly favourites and I will do them more often. Also don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I do upload every Saturday. Have a lovely day and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.